Hi, Anthony here, and in this video I'll walk you through the Explain to Your Video Creator new user interface in version 3.0. Check this video later if you'd like to find out what's new in EVC 3.0. It's packed with a lot of goodness for video creators. So this is what the new user interface looks like. The first thing you'll notice is this area right here. It's a new timeline, and once you open or create a new project, you will see the slides and scenes in this area and the various elements in this area. If you drop down these little arrows for each element, you can assign in and out animations for the elements. These little buttons up top allow you to control the size of the timeline. Small, medium, large, and the hide button essentially hides the timeline. As you will notice, you can see more of the canvas in this view. Well, I don't want to make this video too long, so I won't focus too much on the new timeline in this video, but I will be creating a separate tutorial which goes more in depth on how to use the timeline. In this menu bar up top, there is not much change, but we now have undo and redo buttons. In this section of the menu bar, under settings, you now have API integration for Usign and Pixabay and this will give you access to the thousands of copyright free images from within Explainedio. In this right side panel under the scene tab in the action after scene section you now have more scene to scene transitions. Also you will notice that there is no action before and action after tabs. It's been replaced with the effects tab because you can now control those actions in the new timeline except for the pause after action. Well, those were the main changes in terms of the new user interface in EVC 3.0. At the time of recording this video, it is still in beta. But hope you found this video useful. You will find many more explained your tutorials on my YouTube channel. If you're looking for a specific tutorial, feel free to request and I will do my best to create it. And if you've got any questions, please leave them in the comment section. Thanks for stopping by.